Hello everybody, my name is Leo the Dragon and welcome back to Hitogachi. And, you know, we're playing it again because last time this girl, Nadine, died because we fed her our food that was literally poisoned. So she died. But anyway, there are a couple of endings like where you flirt with her. Okay, it always glitches at the, be at the beginning. So there's the first ending that we did where she died from poisoning the second one there is i think it's when you flirt with her and the third one is when you know you unleash your monster instincts instincts and kill her hello i'm the person assigned to take care of a monster is this the right house indeed it is let's be a good person this time ah good i thought i went to the wrong place for a second here uh-huh wait a minute you're the girl stares at your face. Okay. Yeah, you're the one. This will be my first time taking care of a non-human, so I hope we get along. I'm sure we will. I'm glad you think that too. I I do. Well then, I'll be sorting my things upstairs for a while. I'll see you in a bit. So what should we do on our first day together? We should talk. So where's your family? They went abroad. Oh, I hope they're doing fine over there. I ate them. You spent time talking with Nadine. Cool, time for you to sleep. Yeah, I'll figure out there's a day here on the left, on the top left, and you have morning, evening, and night. That's kind of thing that I didn't notice. You had a well deserved rest. And the background looks like a fucking heart. That's cute. You're doing better than the last time. Yeah, I do. Yeah, sure. Morning, what should we do today? Talk. Have you ever tried taking care of a pet? Uh, they get scared of me. Oh, I don't think you're scary. You talk to Nadine for a little while. Hmm, we're getting closer. Now it's the square. What do you have on your mind? Play! Nadine brought a maracas. Shake, shake, shake. No, uh, no, sorry. You shook the maracas. Hey, um, how am I doing as your caretaker? So-so, I mean, yeah. Really? Thanks. I'll do my best for the rest of the week. Yeah, seven days. Stop trying to be human. Just a little flash would be nice, wouldn't it? No, we need to rest. Okay. Time to wake up and get moving. We will sleep. Oh, I know. Let me tell you a story before you sleep. Once upon a time, there was a girl who leapt through the time and you fell asleep as Nadine continues on with the story. What should we do this afternoon? We are going to talk. Do you go to school? Yeah, but I got a spell expelled. The rectors did tell us something about that. You chatted with Nadine for a bit. Hey, it's getting quite late. Time to sleep. I wonder how it tastes like. No. <laughs> it's been a few days since I started taking care of you. You weren't that bad of a monster. Are you falling for me? Haha, <laughs> you dummy. Okay, let's start the day with a bang. Okay, let's let's play. Nadine brought a PSP, PlayStation Portable. Hey look, I'm sure you'll like this. It's a game where you roll this ball and I played that before. Oh, in that case, will you give me some tips and tricks about it? You played along with Nadine for a bit. Cool, something to do, something to do. Let's uh, eat. The menu for today is soup. Cool, this wouldn't really make you fall, huh? <laughs> Feed me. Uh, uh, well, sure, um... Say, say, ah... Uh... You finished eating and cleaned up. Okay. I will be submitting some reports to the agency tonight. Have a good sleep. Stop trying to be human. Again, we already heard it. No! Sap, no. I will not. We need to rest. Hmm. I didn't get much sleep today. A sleep. Oh, um. I'll sing you a song while you nap. You listen to Nadine as you slowly drifted to sleep. Cool. Any plans to do something? Let's talk. So what are your hobbies? Uh, cooking. I actually enjoy cooking. Whoa, I never thought you'd be into that. I'm a decent cook myself. Would you teach me? You converse with Nadine as, you, as the hours go by. What a good day that was. Well, see you tomorrow. See you too. Blood. No, wake up sunshine. All is well today. Let's eat. The menu for today are bones. Hmm, your gums might hurt from this. I have something else then. 
Yeah, that might be better. You finished eating and cleaned up. Okay, how do we make her fall in love with us? Hmm, ah, I'm a little tired. Then let's talk. Have you ever fallen in love? I fall in for you. Oh, come on. You talked about love for some reason. We are trying to be human. Hmm. So, um, tomorrow's our last day. I'll miss you. Me too. Anyways, I have to prepare for tomorrow. Night night. Yeah, no. We won't eat her. Last day. Let's have fun. Good morning. We should enjoy this moment as much as we can. Let's talk. Nadine sits beside you. Uh, hey. She rests her head on your shoulder. You spend the day with Nadine. I hope that's it. D did we? Wait, what? Nadine is nowhere to be found. Has she left already? Oh no, oh no, what's going on? You felt a presence behind you. Hey! Sorry, I had to um, leave a little early. I uh, went to the agency and uh, asked if I could have an extension on being your care caretaker. Yay! I've, I've grown fond of you and, well, I wanted to spend time with you more. That's me! I'm a purple black haired monster. I love you. Yay! Me, me too. You hugged Nadine. So, what should we do today? <laughs> we did it. We've made her fall in love and we fall in love. We became human? Did we? I don't know. But anyway, this was an interesting ending and I think there's still the last ending where you eat her. But I don't know how that is. It's probably really short. So I'll do that in the next episode and it's probably going to be either short or really long. But anyway, thank you all for watching this episode of Hitagachi. Hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like right down below in the comments. See you next one. Bye bye.